How would you like no sales tax on groceries? Well, that was just one topic discussed at Friday's Hungry for Justice Student Poverty and Hunger Summit. This event was designed to bring college students from across the state together to discuss and encourage action to combat hunger and poverty. We just have a collection of students from around the uh, state of Alabama that are here learning about different policy issues, different uh, actions and um, actors that are happening across the state to address hunger and poverty. People get caught up in the federal, everything that happens on a federal level not realizing necessarily that it's all at the state level where people are most affected by things. Um, so I think that events like this kind of help raise the awareness and make people more aware that it's at the state level where you can really effectuate change. While at the Hungry for Justice Summit, participants were able to attend breakout sessions that went into further detail on issues regarding hunger and poverty, such as human trafficking and Advocacy 101. And that's where uh, different um, statewide nonprofits, different uh, local organizations can highlight some of the work that they're doing to uh, provide services or programs, but also work towards changing policy. Um, relative to these issues. The summit featured Dr. Robin O'Sullivan, a lecturer in the History and Philosophy Department on Troy's Dothan campus, and Senator Gerald Dial as keynote speakers. Dial said he used this platform to push for no sales tax, but to ultimately inspire the attendees to become advocates for the hungry and impoverished. Well, I hope they learned that, that and they sit down and realize each one of them can make a significant difference. Each and every one of us can if we dedicate ourselves to it. The free summit was presented by Troy University's Office of Civic Engagement and Alabama Possible. In Montgomery, Deborah Bogart, Troy, Trojan Vision News.